Alright, so this leg stretcher that CDIY bought is the first time that I actually used it myself. I was training another guy who did purchase this as well, and I saw him using it. And his main, cons his main, um, his main problem with it was this kept raising up, you know. But I don't have that problem now. I think if you weigh a lot, if you weigh like over 200 pounds or something, this may be hard because your legs will be so tight that it's like pushing it in. But if you don't weigh a lot, it, it just moves your feet like very easily. And it works really well, actually. Like, I didn't think it would work that well, but it actually does work pretty well. I do like it. It's worth the money because it's only like $30 where you got these machines that where you spin the wheel. It's over $200 and it takes up a lot of space. This doesn't take up that much space at all. Like, as you can see, you can put it in like this and it, you can just hide it against the wall. So it doesn't take up that much space. Um, it doesn't cost a lot. So I do highly recommend this for people that don't weigh a lot. If you weigh a lot, this thing might not be strong enough for you. Um, and then there's these different notches here. As you get more flexible, you put the notch over here and then you can pull it further. But he's got it at the, at the highest setting right here. That means that this is for the people that are most inflexible. The more flexible you get, you put the notch over here. But we don't got a wrench right now and it's just kind of a hassle to, to switch it right now. So as, as you can see, I'll pull, it, I'll pull it in all the way and I can't go any more right now because this is the limit until I move this notch. But right now I feel the stretch. Actually, maybe he convinced me to buy my own <laughs> for the school. I think this would be good for people. Um, it's affordable and I might, I might get one for the school so other people could use it too. Um, I, I recommend it. I do recommend it. That's good.